So um, if if we compare an uh, internal combustion engine vehicle with an electric vehicle, the first thing you notice is there's just a lot fewer subsystems that can make noise. And these subsystems tend to be quieter. An electric motor is a lot quieter than an engine, especially if you consider the engine as not having an exhaust system and it's not as having an intake system, just how the raw pulsations that come from, from the engine. Um, and then there's just a lot fewer systems. With the ICE, we have an intake system, we have an exhaust system, gone. Turbocharger, gone. Um, fuel injectors, gone. EGR system, gone. So uh, uh, that is quite a difference between the two. On a, but on electric motor, there's really no good place to mount the accessories. On a on an internal combustion engine, we have a belt on the front, and on this belt, we can we can run the oil pump, we can run the water pump, the power steering, the alternator, the AC compressor. Um, we can generate the vacuum for the braking system, and they're bolted to this big piece of metal here. And this big piece of metal is isolated from the car body by um, uh, by electric by rubber mounts. So this is very desirable. On the electric motor, it Generally, maybe you mount the inverter up on top of it. Maybe you mount the uh, high voltage AC compressor on it. But a lot of the other pumps, the water pumps, the oil pumps, would be located on the body. And that's a little bit more problematic because the body isn't nearly as solid as the front of a big block of aluminum. Uh, in an electric vehicle, there's no low, low frequency masking noise. That makes you more aware of wind and road noise. It means that when you pull up it to a stop, you can hear everything that's still going. Um, and also, you can be more aware of transmission and gear, gear noise because there's less masking noise. And to make things worse, an electric motor produces whine rather than producing gentle thump, thump, thump noises or dramatic thump, thump, thump noises. So. Um, that's generally considered a lower uh, sound quality than the internal combustion engine. And there's issues with mounting electric motors. Electric motors produce high torque. That's what they're really good at. They're really good at producing high torque from a standstill. Well, we have to restrain that in order to keep the electric motor from spinning around and hitting something. So we generally need stiffer mounts. Uh, electric motor will almost be almost always be mounted in the transverse direction. That means that the actual shafts come directly out of it. That combined with the high torque um, tends to produce a, the strong torque reaction at low frequency. If, if it was a north-south arrangement, if it was a drive shaft coming out the back, that drive shaft would be turning considerably faster and then it would be geared down at the rear end and uh, there, would, there wouldn't need to be as high of a torque reaction. Electric motors are almost across the board lighter weight than, than um, their ICE counterparts, generally on the order of like 25%. So electric motor may not be a feather, but it's lighter than a, than a, big, than a big V6 or a, or a straight four. And they're also more compact. What does that mean? If they're lighter weight and they're more compact, that means that they're gonna have less rotational inertia Combine that with with stiffer mounts, and what do you get? You get higher natural frequencies. Are higher natural frequencies good? No, they're not, because um, it makes it harder to isolate the high frequency wind noise that, that the motor produces. Electric vehicles have batteries. This is not a very good example because this is, I think this is out of a Chevy Volt, and so this is their T-shaped their battery. That might be a Bolt. Um, it has the T-shaped battery, uh, but all the new batteries I've seen kind of make up the bottom structure of the car. They go from side to side, front to back, and uh, they become part of the structure of the car. Uh, this may turn out to be desirable from an NBH point of view or might not. Uh, generally mounted that way, uh, it 
there's a lot of weight there, but it's not the kind of weight that helps us with noise and vibration. Uh, maybe there, that will be used effectively to reduce road noise. Maybe it won't, but um, uh, gen generally the battery is a lot of weight that's not MVH uh, reducing weight. Yeah. Thank you very much. Uh, we'll take questions now.